I wanted to make a quick video out there just to see how this kind of stuff does. You know, when I stumble across things, why not just release them on YouTube and see what all of you guys think? This actually stems back almost four years back to 2018 involving Dr. Disrespect. If you guys want a full on video with all of the context, I'll gladly lay it out for all of you. Just leave a like and a comment down below. But it was one of the first times where Doc called out something suspicious uh, behind Twitch's closed doors with the upper uppers. He doesn't call out a group of people, he calls out what he says is one individual he thinks likes to flex his power on Doc and one individual that seemingly has a problem with him. This was actually after receiving a warning after he apparently grabbed his crotch in impersonation of Michael Jackson during a Fortnite stream. This led to a, a big response from Doc, but one in particular I'm gonna share with all of you might be one of the first times that he actually called out Twitch and someone maybe not liking him who is also involved with Twitch. Don't ever send me another message! There's someone in Twitch, ladies and gentlemen. And I'd like to meet him. There's someone high up in there that just has a little something for the two-time champion. There's something about it. I know it's not multiple people, because everyone loves a two-time. It's one individual. One. I know it. And he loves to flex his power. And why I bring this up is because, of course, you know, right around three years after this was released and after he called out Twitch, and that is a lengthy amount of time, right? Who's to say the person he is talking about or calling out from Twitch is even there at this point? It's, they've seen a, a lot of turnover. They've seen a lot of higher end employees leave, especially in just the past six months as well, let alone in three years. Who knows? But it is very weird that back in 2018, clearly Doc already had some issues with Twitch and already calling out at least one individual in a very, very powerful situation or powerful seat that does not like him. And then fast forward three years later with some potential contract negotiations, maybe some other theories out there as well. And the Doc is permanently banned off the platform and what will be likely one of the biggest lawsuit cases for streamers versus a platform that we have ever seen. And it started back in 2018. If you guys want the full video, leave a comment, leave a like down below. I'll make it today if you guys really want it. But I just want this channel to be whenever I sit down and I see something that I want to talk about, I freaking talk about it because you guys hopefully like to hear about it. And I really do appreciate all of you guys who do. Drink some water, drink some coffee, spin this theory around. What do you guys think about it? It could mean nothing. It could be absolutely nothing. But it is weird when you find these kind of clips. So until next time, okay, bye.